When you build up a 4x4 like we have our Ranger, you end up adding a fair bit of weight to a car with accessories and other bits and pieces. You're also probably going to be towing heavy stuff like caravans, horse floats, ski boats, those sort of things. So you're putting extra strain on your braking performance. Now we haven't had any troubles at all with our Ranger the way we drive it, but the Ford Ranger isn't known for having great brake performance. A lot of people seem to complain about it, particularly when towing. So before we go out and do any heavy duty towing with the car, we're going to update the pads and rotors with some new products from Protex. So here we've got our Protex brake products. We've got a pair of four-wheel drive specific brake rotors and the disc pads themselves. Let's check them out. So here we've got our brake rotor and our brake pads. Now, for anyone who doesn't know how the brake works, the disc brake works, this spins with your wheel, these clamp in on either side and stop it when you apply the brake pedal. That's putting it really simply, but that's how it works. That obviously generates a lot of heat, and a big part of braking efficiency is getting rid of that heat. To do that, these Protex rotors have got veins inside here. Now these dissipate more heat out of the rotor. These rotors have also got these little grooves inside here, which gets dust and dirt out of the braking surface, keeps it nice and clean so the pad is able to grip nicely on it. Another nice thing about these Protex products, they've got a special coating on them from the factory. With other products, you might have to give them a wipe down with some Prepsol first before you put them in there, clean them up. These ones have got a coating on here that keeps them nice and clean. There's no rust surface on there at all. So ready to bolt straight on. The pads themselves sort of dissipate heat once again. They've got no copper in them. A lot of the brake pads have got copper in them, which all comes off the rotor as dust, gets into the waterways, kills fish. So yeah, low, low copper is a good thing. About time to get them on the car. So here we have our new Protex brake disc rotors and brake pads installed on the Ranger. So you see the disc rotor there and the pads are tucked away inside the caliper, which is what clamps down on there when you apply the brake to stop the wheel spinning. So we'll get the wheels back on it now, take it out and give it a road test. We've got our Protex pads and rotors fitted in the Ranger now and they're bedded in quite nicely. They feel nice and smooth. There's no vibration or anything like that. They're quiet, smooth, responsive, even pedal pressure. The real test will come once we get out in the bush with some load in the car, maybe the camper trailer on the back, coming down some nice big steep high country hills, see how they feel there. But you know, the idea is that you won't have any brake fade, nice consistent brake applications. It should be great when we get out in the bush. <laughs>